Hey everybody, Claude Junior 9 here, and today I'm doing a review on Wydowna, uh, I don't know why it says Widow, <laughs> apparently that was a really bad idea. So it's Wydowna, Daughter of Arachne. This is a custom doll by Bratz Boy on Flickr, and it is amazing. And just, yeah, it's great. <laughs> so, um, a lot of people have been wanting her. I really wanted Wydowna as a doll, uh, but she didn't get released yet. Apparently, she should be released, um, but there's no guarantee on that. Uh, I We didn't make the back of the box, so I'll just show you the front. Um, her diary says Wydowna. The box wasn't exactly finished. It just says Venomous Vixen draped in black. She doesn't have a pet. Obviously, it's Rochelle's box because it says Rue. Um, it's just checkered print around the box and then the doll so I will take her out now and here she is out of the box and she is flawless love her so um we're gonna start at the bottom from the top like always um I repainted her shoes like really badly so yeah you can blame me for that um so, uh, yeah, they're, ah, it's like chipping, terrible, so, um, they're just black with yellow around it, and yeah, it's terrible, I did a terrible job, I'm sorry, <laughs> I really, like, brought this custom down, um, she has the pink tights, this dress was made by Chadalyn07, I don't remember, I don't quite remember, I think it's just Chad Allen on, um, YouTube now, I will put the link in the description and I just added the um purple here I know it's kind of like rigid and messed up and the pink over here it's because the um lines were a little too thin in my opinion but he did a really amazing job it looks exactly like the promo for her it's perfect so thank you so much um her belt is black kind of has some silver um highlights on the belt um, she has a vest that is coming off, uh, but yeah, her vest has some fringe on the bottom, just slightly, and she has, um, Wave One Golia's necklace. Her hair is really pretty, um, it's in this little bump, like Wave One Frankie, except it's really curly, and it's, uh, like a deep red with purple highlights, and it's gorgeous. She has a Widow's Peak, of course. Um, I should go into all her accessories. Uh, being that she's a spider, she has six arms and two legs, which, you know, makes the eight, um, thing. So, um, she has a bracelet. And her hands, they're all shaped exactly, like, in the promo for her. So, yeah, um, she has bracelets. Another bracelet. I don't know why it's not focusing on the right thing. Alright, there we go. So she has those bracelets, and then, uh, the fishnet, um, arm warmer or something, <laughs> a yellow bracelet and a red bracelet, another red bracelet with a red glove, and a pink, uh, arm warmer again. Now onto her gorgeous face, um, as you can tell, she is, uh, really dark skin colored, she's very black because she is a widow. Which, no, that doesn't mean her husband died. <laughs> um, so she has uh, six eyes. The two eyes up here. Uh, she's looking up that way with Bratz Boy's um, signature side eye look. Her makeup is uh, like a aqua type turquoise blue with some dark purple under there too. Her eyes are a beautiful red. I really love her eyes. And then her lips are really gorgeous, too. They're like a deep red with bangs, like on the promo. So um, I really love how she came out, uh, thanks to Chatelain and Bratz Boy. She came out amazing and looks so much like the promo. I really love her. I can't wait to use her in all stop motions and everything. She is so amazing. I hope everybody feels the same way about her. Uh, sorry about no Mega Monster problems yet, but there will be episode 3 very soon. 
Um, I'm trying to get some of the customs that Brats Boy's making for me in there. Uh, there's a lot of them coming um, soon, so yeah, I really want them to be in Mega Monster Problems. So, uh, episode 3 will be up soon, probably sometime this week. I can't guarantee anything, I'm really sorry, but it will be up. So, thanks for watching. Hope you liked her. Later!